you know what? I'm gonna need y'all to give me a medal, okay? I need a gold medal right now for the amount of times I be saving y'all lives, okay? With these tutorials, I, the looks are endless this month, okay? 25 days, all right? Sis has been coming through with these looks that are inexpensive, because y'all know I'm a frugal individual. So we gonna go ahead and get into the tutorial, because I know y'all ready for the details. I know y'all ready for the tea on this one. Let's get into it. Sugaboo, welcome back to another hair tutorial here on my channel, Put Note with the Pompons. My name is Shantae. Welcome back to a, another tutorial. So in this one, I created another hat wig. Um, this time I went with a longer length and I wanted to do like a winter edition. In this tutorial, I'm going to be showing you guys how I created my hat wig. Stay tuned. And if you are new to our channel, don't forget to hit that subscribe button located right down below. And to all of my returning subscribers, hey bestie, hey mama, hey friend, hope you are being safe and blessed as always. Let's go ahead and jump straight into the tutorial. All right, let's go ahead and get into the supply list. We're gonna need a dome cap, canvas head, two bundles of hair, T-pins, hair glue, and some scissors, all right? So make sure when you place your dome cap wig onto your canvas head that you have a plastic wrap plastic bag, whatever, some kind of barrier between that glue and your canvas head. Because if you don't, you gonna end up having a permanent wig on your canvas head, boo, all right? Trust me, I've learned this one the hard way. I've done it several times. I glued the wig to my damn canvas head. So I'm opening up my very inexpensive hair bundles. I purchased these from my local beauty supply store because I was just a little, a little skeptical about them, them sellers on Amazon when it comes to some human hair bundles. And plus I didn't want nothing too great and grand because I am using this as as a hat wig it's not about to be a lace frontal or anything like that so these bundles only cost me $30 and I picked up two packs so $60 all together and this ain't no 10 a gray human hair this is just some Yankee some Yankee Yankee human hair okay honey not, nothing great and grand just something that's gonna get the job done that's all we need So I am also a very impatient person, okay? <laughs> my money is short and so is my attention span. So I don't like sitting here waiting for these tracks to dry. So I get my handy dandy T-pins and I pin them suckers into the canvas head so they can hold my track together while they sit there and dry. Now once I'm done with the entire wig and I'm done gluing all my tracks down, I let this sucker sit overnight so the next morning she is completely dry and she's ready to be styled. Continue the same process of laying your tracks from one side of the edge cap to the other side using your T-pins to hold it down in place. And then once we meet at the front, we're then going to lay a few tracks in the back to cover up that hole that we usually have whenever we wear a baseball cap. So I'm just showing the front. This is how close I have the tracks together. As you can see that thread that's on the dome cap, I'm using that as my guide. So if you have a smaller head, I am big head friendly. Big, I got a five head, okay? So I made my tracks come just a little bit closer in the front just to help with my forehead, you know, problem. But if you have a smaller forehead, just leave the gap a little bit wider. Easy peasy lemon squeezy. This took me about 20 to 30 minutes to lay everything down. And of course I allow it to dry overnight. All right, babe, so that is the end of the tutorial. This is the finished look. I took a couple of pictures already because I really do like this. Like I really, I really do like this. Like I don't, I don't know if it's just like the hats are just like chef kisses right now. It's like a quick style, something I can really just throw on without having to worry about gluing, lacing, melting, or any of that, that stuff like that. Um, It's a quick style to change up. Like I literally change up my hairstyles on the daily. And it's really mostly because of my crochet wigs and this hat wig. Thank you guys for joining us on a, another video. Don't forget to participate in our 25 days of giveaways. It is coming to a close, okay? We have like nine more days to go. And it's crazy. I've really been doing really good on my 25 days, like uploading 25 videos straight. 
has been hectic. Thank you guys and everyone who has been participating in our giveaways. We greatly appreciate y'all and we love having y'all here. Welcome to the family. And we want to wish everybody a happy holidays. Merry Christmas, Kwanzaa, Hanukkah, whatever you are celebrating during this merry time of the year. Be safe and be blessed.